All right, so today I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to take uh, a list of uh, variables and using webhooks turn them into uh, a WordPress blog post. So as you can see, I have this template, which is a very simple blog template. It's going to give you an intro and outline, three paragraphs, and then like a conclusion. So. Uh, this is the CSV for it. So we have the doc name, the doc about the document. We have a tag, which is new. So this tag makes it easy to, to export uh, all the documents once they're done. I've called this travel underscore 2022. Then we have a webhook URL that we get from Padlet Connect, which is going to end up uh, generating blog posts for each of the uh, documents that come back. And you can customize this any way you want. But right now, uh, we're just getting the document name and the document uh, itself. Uh, we're not doing anything fancy. You might want to uh, not post it automatically. So I think there's a way to say, to change the status. So yeah, I'm saying publish, but you can just put it in pending so you can edit it within uh, uh, WordPress once it gets generated. Um, so yeah, these are the only two posts I'm gonna to, to, to have now. Uh, just so we can see it working. So let's go ahead and upload them now. So let me go ahead and save this CSV file. Let's see here. All right. So that's saved. I'm going to rename it as a webhook test. All right. So now let's upload it here. Let me open up my test site. So yeah, right now we have no posts. Uh, so let's go ahead and upload a webhook test. So two rows, 12 generations are needed. Create those two documents right now. And those are processing. While they're processing, we can go to the log and see the doc here. So they're still processing. Uh, all right. Looks like they're done. All right, so it looks like they're done. So if we refresh, you should see, yeah, we should see our two blog posts now in WordPress, which is pretty cool. Uh, obviously, you might want to massage them and edit them to your liking, but uh, it makes it really easy to get a lot of things to WordPress from niches or any other application with this new webhook addition. Uh, also, if we go back to documents and if we wanted to export this, these two documents, we can click that and download as a text, which will give us a zip file with those two documents inside of it. Or we can download a CSV, which will have each post as a CSV. Um, all right. So I hope that helps. That's using webhooks uh, in niches. Uh, have a good day.